hello guys you're welcome to my youtube channel my name is blessing oc joy if you're new here you're welcome please do also like this video share with your friends and do not forget to click on the notification button so you can always be the first person to get notified each time i upload a new video here so guys in today's video i'm going to be showing you a detailed steps on how to make moi moi with your moi moi leaves Without any further ado, let's get right into the video. So first of all, you want to make sure you pick your beans to avoid stone because you're going to be blending it later. And if you're not careful, you're going to blend stone with the beans and the momo is going to be sandy. So after picking it, go ahead to add water so you can separate the good part from the dirt. Instead of using my hand to peel the beans, I'm going to be using the blender. This method is quite easy and quick. This is how it works. All you have to do is to pour your beans into the blender, then add enough water. Blend using the pulse function. After peeling the beans with the blender, all you have to do is to add water and sieve out the peels from the beans until you have a plain, clean beans without peel. Then your washed beans is ready. I have a video of this whole process in my YouTube short, so you can just go over there and watch the whole process. So while at this, I'm also boiling my eggs and my fish that I'm going to use for the moi moi. Yeah, so this is how it turned out after using the blender to wash and sieve out the peels. So at this point, I'm going to be peeling the onions I need for the moi moi. Afterwards, I'm going to be taking out the seeds from my tatashi. That's also called um, red bell peppers. Now, I didn't use shombo, that's a cayenne pepper. If you want a very fine looking moi moi, then go ahead to add your shombo. Of course, I used the uh, albanero pepper, that's a tarado. So at this point, I'm going ahead to blend my beans with my blender. the beans so at this point I'm going to give it a good mix before adding every of my ingredients these are the list of ingredients I'll be needing for this moi moi recipe I have my meat stock my chicken seasoning I have my eggs fish salt crayfish and bonga fish then lastly oil The first thing I usually add to my beans butter is my stock, my fish stock and my beef stock. Afterwards, I give it a good mix. Next, I go in with my crayfish and my bonga fish, the blended ones. Next, I added my eggs. Most people add their eggs with each scoop. I don't do that. It's actually dependent on what you want. The next thing I'm adding is my deboned fish. I'm using Titus fish. 
So like I said earlier, I usually add my salt and chicken seasoning at the end after I have added all my after I have added my major ingredient to elevate the taste. At this point, give everything a good mix and add your oil. Mix properly and add hot water to your desired consistency. Do not make it too watery, neither should you make it too hard, just to your desired consistency. Yeah, basically. <laughs> After I added the water, I gave everything a good mix and went ahead to rinse my moi moi leaves. I've had this in the fridge for a week now and it stayed fresh. So you can have this, your leaves in the freezer for as long as you want right and it maintains its nature i also have a video on my youtube shorts on how to wrap moi moi with moi moi leaves so in case you can't really get how i'm doing this you can just run over to my youtube short and the video is there so basically i just do this on the repeat then I put it in pots on fire. When my balls on. So I do all of this process on a repeat. Then afterwards I add everything to the pot. Boil with little water. Moi moi needs steam to cook. So cover properly and allow to cook. For 45 to 1 hour, your moi moi will be ready. If you're still watching till this point, Thank you. Please go ahead and like this video. Give this video a thumbs up. One hour later. So guys, our moi moi is ready. Thank you guys so much for watching till the very end of this video. Please, if you like this video, please like it, share it, and do not forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Thank you. Bye. See you in my next video. Oh.